right, good Friday morning. And that camera's a little foggy. Clean that up real quick. Today is Friday, the 13th of September. I got home Wednesday night on the 11th. Uh, I was actually home for 36 hours when I took off this morning. It wasn't exactly what I wanted to do, but I was hoping to get out of the house yesterday. But it all worked out for the best, I guess. Um, I got this load yesterday. I was going to leave last night, and I said, you know what, I'll just leave in the morning. It's not like I have a, a huge deadline that I needed to rush for, so I got up early this morning, got up about 5 o'clock, um, did a couple things I had to do and got out the door. By the time I got back to the truck, it was 36 hours that I'd been home, uh, and then I rushed up here. I got up here about 9.45, and then uh, now it's, what is it? Normally it has the time up there on the GPS. Uh, 10.47. So we've been here about an hour now. Uh, Got to go over here, get strapped down over here by the tarping station. And then I'm just going back home. Now uh, this load goes down to Lancaster, New York, or Lancaster, Pennsylvania. And then uh, it looks like I'm going to have another load coming out of Carlisle. Uh, going out to Minnesota for next week. Uh, but this will deliver Monday morning, so I'm going to head back down to the house, actually be able to get some stuff done down at the house, um, and then I'm going to leave out Sunday Sunday late afternoon. I'll get down to Lancaster get, so that I can get unloaded early Monday morning, which I'll probably sleep right on site, but we'll see as... Uh, as we get closer to that to that time. So get this load strapped down and ready to go. Alright, so the biggest difference I'm sitting here scratching my head trying to figure out why the straps aren't going quite the same as they normally do. So the biggest thing is we actually have what I've been doing lately is only seven stacks. And this time I got eight. I got two short in the front. And then the rest are tall. Well, four, and then I got three stacks of three in the front, two, and then what is it, six? Six stacks of four. Um, so I had to do two straps, one strap, two straps, one strap for the rest, and then two straps for the back. I had to take a quick look back real quick because I, I've only been doing, I've been doing two straps, two straps, one on the rest, and then two on the back. And uh, when I looked back in the videos, I realized that the, there was a, uh, I don't even know what I was trying to say. When I looked back in the video, I realized there was one less stack. So I, I got, I got more than I had been carrying lately. Um, as I started doing it the normal way that I do it, in my doing my routine, and like I said, I was doing two in the front because it was a short stack. You had to have two in the front, and then the next stack was bigger, so you had to have another two there because there was nothing blocking that top one. So it had to be portrayed as the front stack again. Um, but in this case, I, was, I, I had the two stacks of three in the front, so I was able to do two. Then the next one behind it, you don't need to do two straps. And then the next, the first tall one, you had to do two straps, two stacks, two straps. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Let's see if I get my words right. Anyway. <laughs> We're all loaded up, head back to the guard shack, get our paperwork, and uh, head back home. And we'll have the rest of the day at home, and then tomorrow. I should be home about 4 o'clock today. It's 12, 12 now. 
by the time I uh, get my paperwork and I'll probably stop again maybe along my route going down and grab something for lunch we will uh, I'll figure it out you guys won't really be around for it anyway we'll probably see you Monday I'm getting tired of your bullshit I'm tired of your voice I'm getting tired of the way you leave me hanging with no choice if you would ask me long ago
could have done it again, but instead of just putting up the, uh, the little thanks for watching thing, I figured I'd come on here and say, uh, we got over there to the delivery, got right on the scale, got checked in, went down, unstrapped and everything. Guy came over, took the paperwork, pulled me over, unloaded me, beeped the horn, and I was gone. So, scaled out, took a quick look at the tires, make sure there was nothing in there, because they had a bunch of metal stuff down there on the ground. I'll have to look them over again by the time I get down here to Carlisle. I'm only about 20 miles from there now. Uh, just make sure that there's nothing in the tires. I don't think I picked anything up, but if I did, one of the tires would be soft by the time we get down there, so. Anyway, that's it. I'll move on to the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe.